the new ballet company is performing the Nutcracker at the California Theater. A trip to History San Jose in 1905. They uh, allowed us to tour their archives and um, research costumes uh, with dolls and outfits they had from that period. Um, they let us uh, uh, use archival art from their collection in our slideshows that introduce both the first act, which is in 1905, downtown San Jose, and our second act, which is set in the Valley of Hearts Delight, which is what the area was known during the Orchard era. Besides the company, New Ballet School is the only ballet school certified by American Ballet Theater with over 170 students. I have more dancers than ever, and it really is so exciting. There are many exquisite scenes in the Nutcracker, but for me, the land of snow is just breathtaking. I thought a lot about the structure of snowflakes, kind of the, the angular crystalline shape of snowflake and snowflakes, little snowflakes, and tried to capture that in the choreography. Sorsha started at the school in 2015. Tonight is her first night as an official company dancer. It really is. Um, it was my dream ever since I was two or three years old. Something crazy. The Nutcracker is a ballet tradition of the capital of Silicon Valley. Wouldn't be the same holiday season without the Nutcracker. And I think the Nutcracker here, the San Jose Nutcracker, is a beautiful blend of bringing ballet tradition and also the forward thinking that we do at New Ballet. For dancer Rebecca, playing Clara for three years is a sign of hope for her community. I feel like I can keep expanding every year that I do it. This is my third year doing it. So there's always something to add to it. The New Ballet Nutcracker runs through December 23rd at the California Theater. In San Jose, Glitzo Martins for News Up Now.